वेलकम गाइज इन अवर टैलेंट ओपन स्टूडियो इन दिस सेशन वी आर गोइंग टू लर्न हाउ टू मूव योर फाइल फ्रॉम वन लोकेशन टू अनदर लोकेशन इन दी आइडियल सिचुएशन वी गेट द फाइल फ्रॉम एफ टी पी सर्वर और एनी अदर लोकेशन देन बिफोर प्रोसेसिंग दिस फाइल वी नीड टू मूव दिस फाइल फ्रॉम अवर सोर्स टू अवर डेस्टिनेशन इन्वायरमेंट that means our production environment so how can we do that in talent so here you can see how you can see we have the input file there there are there are four files you can see that and we want to move this file to another location before processing okay so we are going to back our talent open studio so we are going to use t file list T file list component is very useful component in case if you want to move more than one file then this component gives a feature to us to deliver all the files uh, including sub directory to another location so if i am going to click on it you can see there is a file path directory path so i what i am going to do here i am just going to click it and in this pc in a drive yeah so i am going to choose the file path and input this is the folder where all the files are available now you can see there is a file list option you can choose file directory and both but we are talking about the files so we are going to choose files and there is a check box which is asking including sub directory if you want to move your sub directory as well you can select this folder also check box also generate error if no file found or suppose that you have built a job but anyhow there is no file and you want to track it definitely we are going to choose this option over here okay now what we are going to do uh, we have the file source directory now we want to see the actual file path so i am going to use t java t java component is a very useful component if you want to write some custom code so it gives you a functionality a way where you can write your own code so here i am going to just go to the t java component and change the variable name where and actual file path okay now we want to pull the actual file path so what i am going to do where equal where plus then you can go to the t java file list and get the current file path okay now go to the end and semicolon then using system dot out dot print ln okay then pass this argument this variable now what i am going to do i am going to iterate my t file list to t java and going to run this job right now now you can see the actual file path where the file from where they are going to be moved to another location so now we are going to use t t file component copy component t file copy component okay 
now we have dragged t file copy component now we are going to connect our t java component to t file component so just click on t file copy component here we need to change the file name so what we are going to do here this is the by default file name so just go to the file list and choose t uh, current file path okay now uh, if you want to copy a directory you can choose this option also but we are not going to use this option so we are going to destination directory so first of all what we are need to do i'm just going to this directory and go to my e directory here there is a path where i need to put and choose input okay now i want to uh, change this uh, by using talent date dot get date we are going to provide the format that is cc yy is going to be add with the input folder okay now we are going to down you can see there is a another option if you want to rename it and remove source file suppose that after processing this file you want to remove all the files from the source then you can choose this option as well now there is another option another checkbox replace existing file suppose if you already run this job and files also placed from source to dest destination and you are going to run this again definitely in this case it will replace the existing files create the directory if it does not exist okay in case like our case we have created a new directory with uh, date uh, yymmdd format so if it is not available that means it is going to create a new directory and fail on error you want to select this option this checkbox if you want to track the error so guys our job is ready to run so we are going to run this job now you can see these files are moving okay now we are going to our folder and we can see that uh, this folder has been created here and these are the files and you can see the file also so guys it is very easy to <coughs> move your file from one source to another source by using t file list t java or t file copy component so guys please subscribe my youtube channel for more videos on talent ssrs ssis sql server data warehouse modeling azure python and for the power bi please don't forget to press the bell icon thank you for watching us